Hello YouTube, this is Keith Kevin Ken. How you doing? How you doing? Man, I hope you're doing well. It's time again for another knife of the day. On Saturday, if you're just watching me, I showed off a brand new Spydeco knife. Go check that out. Today, it's a Monday, <laughs> as I wrote on my Instagram. By the way, Instagram is at Keith Kevin Ken. Every day I post several pictures always of uh, the pocket dump etc today i said it's time for the rats to start racing it's also time for us to pay <laughs> to earn all the money to pay for all these new knives well today the new knife is the brand new just released spyderco mcb mcb it's brand new it's designed by jonathan mcneese it's based on his custom knife, and this little eeny beeny knife really has a lot of things that are custom about it. So let's talk a little bit about it, okay? Um, I love little knives. This is a real little knife. In fact, at the end of this, I'm going to compare this to the Man Bug and the Techno. And let me just say this, the man bug is bigger. Yeah. So this is a big, thick knife. I think it's like the ultimate um, keychain knife that can do big boy things. Spydeco is very good at doing small knives that do good work and feel nice in even big Michelin man hands like mine. And the McBee is just like that. Great steel, CTS, XHP steel on it, which is really nice. It's a Warncliffe blade, so of course, very easy to use. I also love the shape of the blade. Easy to get your finger on top and really do some work with this small knife. Again, I like small knives, and I'm talking, you know, 2.5 inch, 3 inch. This, 1.5 inches. 1.5 inches. It's legal everywhere. And I love how they have the little guard here so you don't slip up. No jimping. But for this little knife, Spydeco, or even early on, had a range of knives that they called their little big knives. This here is a little big knife. Sturdy as all get out. Of course, it has the hole. So you have a hump, but I love how they use that hump to have a slope right there that you can work on. The, tide, the entire knife is just 3.8 inches total. Total! 1.7 ounces but man look how it's built the scales are titanium thick scales look see how thick the scales are open construction easy to clean the standoffs the uh a decent sized lanyard hole with the lanyard tube if you're gonna try to do this as a keychain knife knife and it's heavy i always use a keychain knife because I just have a silver loop with three keys on it. So I always have a keychain knife that makes my keychain different every day and actually functional. This is really functional. But you could put it in your fifth pocket, take off the clip, just slide it in. Um, has that, I love the design, the holes cut through the show sides see the blade that goes through it look at the little pivot and this is off of McNeese style usually he has nickel nickel kind of pivots that are worked out by hand you know like a with a ball bear a ball hammer or so and this of course it's not custom it's a production knife but you know what I mean it's not your standard pivot doesn't that look great and what I think Spydeco does better than anyone else 
when you get to a knife this size, they integrate the Chris Reeve Interco frame lock better than anyone else on a knife this size. And you guys know they do that a lot on smaller knives. The clip, solid clip. Now usually this is where I go, I wish it was a wire clip because I like wire clips, but a knife like this also, and I learned this from a buddy of mine with my Cricut collection. I love my Cricuts. And he said, you know, I use my Cricut as a money clip. And so sometimes with these smaller knives, you know, put a credit card, some bills through there. It's a long, it's a short clip, but this is so small, it makes it look like a long clip. First time I took it out of the box, I'm like, why do I have this long clip? But that's actually the short clip, and you'll see when I compare it to other knives just how small this is. But man, it feels good in the hand. That's magic when they are able to do that. One clip, only right hand, tip up, clip. But again, as I said, you can even remove that clip and put it in your small kind of uh, pocket or even take off the clip, put a nice lanyard on it with a bead, throw it in your pocket, have the lanyard easy to pull the knife out. This, my friends, is a nice little knife. <laughs> I liked it better than I thought I would. And with that Warren Cliff blade, sharp, of course, it's Spartaco right out of the box. I'm liking it. Little Mighty Mouse. You guys too young for that? The Little Mighty Mouse? That's what this reminds me of. A lot of knife in a small package. That is the brand new Spartaco McB just released. Yes, you know it's small, but did you know that's the man bug? Did you know it was that small? Huh? And look at the Techno. Whoops, sorry. The Techno looks like a beast of a knife, doesn't it? <laughs> the Techno looks like a beast. So that gives you a good feel for this super small knife. I think Spyderco did it well. Of course, I love small knives. Of course, and you'll have to get a nice loop to put this keychain because it has, you'll have to do it through the lanyard hole with a tube. You have to have, a, I'll have I have a different kind of keychain I need to use with this. But what a wonderful little knife for me. Little Mighty Mouse knife. It's the Spyderco McB. Tomorrow, a brand new fixed blade knife from Spyderco. Then I'm out of town for two days, so you'll get a little hole uh, for two days, and then I'm back on Friday. I hope you guys have a perfect day. Go check out the playlist. There's a whole bunch of knives. How about using uh, Wednesday, Thursday when I'm away to check out all those knives there? I really appreciate each and every one of you. Check out the knife that I posted on Saturday, and check out all the wonderful comments. A lot of them correcting some of the things I said. I just really appreciate that. That's community. When an idiot like me falls down on some of the facts and everyone is so kind and, and everything professional about it, I really appreciate that. So go check those out. You guys have a perfect day. Take good care of yourselves. Goodbye.